what is up everybody it is completely dark we have started fishing a tournament this morning it's a pretty big tournament probably close to 100 boats i know y'all probably can't see my face but we're out here it's six o'clock in the morning it is pitch black sun won't rise until about 6 30 or so but we're gonna try to catch them actually our very first cast over here we got a bite we're probably not 100 yards away from where we took off we just came right over here to some boat docks but anyways, y'all stick with it and stay tuned. I will hope you enjoy. I know it's been a minute since I post, but we're going to pitch this tournament. If I catch anything or if I don't, I'm still going to post it. So, hope y'all enjoy. fish that we caught on the buzzbait this morning if y'all can see that it's just a 15 incher right at a keeper you know a solid pound and a half fish or so real fun to catch but anyways that's the one keeper that we caught that y'all probably didn't see because it was in the dark but there he is right there well i don't know if y'all can... i don't know if y'all can see me good but Anyways, we've been fishing this tournament. It's uh, not been the greatest day. I got a bunch of bunch of bites on a buzz bait this morning, you know, and I've kind of gotten some small ones throughout the day, but nothing really big. I had one other one. I've got one keeper that I caught this morning in the dark at like 6.15, it's, you know, not five minutes into takeoff this morning. I already had one in the boat and I was fishing right next to the boat ramp, but that's what we were doing. I'll show y'all buzz bait set up. I got a couple of bites on a jig, but not really much. This is the buzz bait I was using right here. This is just a quarter ounce Strike King, I think Hack Attack Select buzz bait. Real little, it's got the little head banger thing, so it makes that good clicking noise. Real little blade and stuff. This is not a full size buzz bait. During the fall time, I like to throw a little bit smaller buzz bait. It just works a little bit better for those tiny, those tiny shad and stuff that they're feeding on the tiny bait. So this works good. I put paired that up with a Zoom Z Crawl Junior, just a Zoom Z Crawl Junior in white on the back. And then I was throwing this on a 7-1 medium fast action Ducket Pro Series rod with a Shimano Kaya 7.2 to 1. And you know, fishing this all day, I think I really needed to go up maybe an 8.0 to 1 gear ratio reel, something a little bit faster just to help me move the bait and get the fish out of the cover and stuff but that's the setup right there 18 pound fluorocarbon i've been changing this up been testing some things out with a buzz bait i usually use braid but i tried the, the fluorocarbon and it actually wor has worked really really well haven't lost many but that's the buzz bait right there if y'all can't see that also so that's pretty much it i don't want to bore y'all with all the talking i know i haven't been posting much lately but I'm going to try to get back into the things. We have qualified for regionals at the Music City Division BFL, so we'll be heading down to Lake Eufaula in a week, and we'll spend a week down there practicing and then fish the two-day, possibly three-day if we qualify for the third-day tournament. So best of luck to qualify for the All-American. That's pretty much it. You know, Apex Tackle Company, I've been fishing with a lot of their products. Y'all check them out. They're an awesome company that helps me out a little bit. But, you know, Apex Tackle Company, they have some awesome jigs. Y'all check them out. 
Anyways, hit that like and subscribe button. And as always, folks, chase your dreams.